Hello dear friends, good evening. So today, today we will do a blah 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 and uh, we talk about nothing but uh, pain. So today, <laughs> Today my head hurts very, 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 very much. And, uh, so it's so pain. So I kind of, kind of uh, able to understand people who, who have pain and uh, I'm becoming less mean on not understanding other people. Do not be mean. Everybody will have the share of, uh, of suffering pain. Sometimes it just happens. And uh, we do not have to make any effort. The pain just visits us. Sometimes, for some reason, sometimes does not even have a reason. And uh, we think we need to be... Sorry, what I'm talking about. Anyway. Being in pain is such a painful thing. It is... Uh, a very painful thing. Headache or something. It's a very painful thing. And uh, stress makes us uh, pain. And uh, feeling lost makes us pain and uh, when things out of our control we feel pain because uh, we cannot control the situation and, uh, it's a very sudden thing that uh, if sometimes things out of our hand, we cannot control. And uh, and at this time, our brain does not function. So there. I'm thinking sometimes I do painting, I do drawing, and I do this and that so that uh, I can I can relax myself and uh, and um, control my my emotion and control our emotion, our sentiment, and control ourselves. But actually, when pain happens. When sometimes we are in stress, it's very momentum. No, no momentum is not a word. It's not, It's very instant. It's very, um, very short. Very sudden. Suddenly, we 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 are in pain, in stress, and. Uh, 
and then we lost our sense to control the situation. And it is not, there is no time for you to sit down to do a drawing to calm down yourself. These kind of things happen. And I think it's kind of a habit, or, or maybe it's a, it's a skill, if I say, would be a better word. It is a skill to control our temper. And, um, and uh, well, that's pretty. And learn to control ourselves and learn to to have the right exit of our emotion is, uh, is uh, very important, important skill to manage our anger, to manage. So very often time we just need to learn to manage our anger and uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. I am totally lost because I didn't do a good job today and uh, who gave me the right to talk about this? I do not have a right to talk about this. Maybe I have the right to talk about this because because um, I do not want this happen to you, to another person, to anybody who is kind, nice, and thoughtful to, to have this uh, uncontrollable situation to control our emotion. That is not good. Maybe I just want to to say that uh, sometimes I receive friends' email or message either from Facebook or from, from uh, email from YouTube, telling me that uh, they suffer pain, acute pain or something. And um, I am very sorry to hear that you are in pain and what I can do, I want to say is that uh, everybody has the sense of joy, happiness, and pain. It is part of our life. You are in pain, you are not alone. We all make mistakes, we all have pain, and even we do not make mistake. We still have pain. It's part of our human emotion. It's part of our life. Do not be afraid and um, try to avoid bad things to happen. Try to avoid ourselves become too emotional or 
or learn the skill to adjust our our feeling to have a good vent venting place for our emotion. I don't know. Today I'm very very pain because uh, I was hoping I can be relaxed and the real the real life is actually more stressful than than what I have thought. So I think I I just need to stop and uh, and um, need to stop a little bit and uh, relax myself and uh, treat myself with respect otherwise my machine will not run well well so it's better to stop bad things from to prevent bad things from happening by actively by actively taking action to rest to relax then pushing ourselves to the extreme until bad things to happen and, uh, I just want to just want to do some blah 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 to share with you this very very momentary thought. So that I can do something. So when things out of control, we feel very much lost and feel the sense of failure. And, uh, this happens to everybody, anybody. So, so you are not alone. So I do not know what I'm talking about. And, uh, I do not really want to know what I am about to talk. I am I need to release some of this stress and pressure and uh, the accumulated too much things, too many things just need to stop, just need to not do things it will be good for if we, if we actively stop, if we know when to stop, where to stop, and uh, stop when we need to stop. Life is to be enjoyed, is to be cherished. Do not allow ourselves to to spoil our our good life by being 
senseless being careless. Do I have more cards? One cards. Don't cry. Argentina, they choose the
Mm-hmm.
in my things and uh, there was one <coughs> one video on blah 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 on standing stand on top of the things you do actually now I'm giving it a second thought stand on top of the things you do so often times we push ourselves too hard and uh, want it to stand on top of things we do and then the demand has becoming too much more than what we can then it dries ourselves into a very tough situation if you want to stand on top of things everything on top of everything you do you may end up not able to relax not able to take a rest for example there are a million emails you need to control you need to take care of if you want to stand on top of these things you may end up just solving writing emails replying messages without even a chance for yourself to eat drink man woman right so all is relative it is all relative you do what you can do you get what you get and uh, don't I forgot in the kindergarten there is a word you get what you get and don't get upset don't don't get upset or something like it you do what you can do and uh, compromise with life with your desire with your boss's requirement you can only do this much you push yourself too much you end up not having your life and uh, it does not worth it okay. does not worth it nothing is more important than your own life mm -hmm. sorry if you do not live a happy life good life your work cannot be efficient effective and uh, nothing will turn out to be right just so oh that's good the chocolate color like this chocolate color this is a little bit strange but this one is not too bad do i have a chocolate color yeah this one has a chocolate in it yeah do not so one of the very important life skill is to compromise with life and uh, stand on top of things as much as you can and if you cannot do not stress yourself too much push yourself too much until you break does not was it live your life truly sincerely honestly and if that is as much as you can do then that is as good as you can do no need to stress yourself too much 
too much. I'm going to stop here. I want to stop here. I want to stop here. Right here. Right now. Right here. Right now. What you get, you do what you do, you do not get upset. You do not worry if other people are upset about what you do and how you do. Maybe I should just Tell myself, calm down, calm down, calm down, 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 calm down, calm down, calm down, 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 down. Keep saying this. Maybe this can become part of my habit or half part of my thinking process. What do you think? Calm down, calm down, calm down, 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 calm down, calm down, calm down. Come down, 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 come I wanna be a billionaire. So, uh uh, but.
Look at that candy sky. They are so pretty.